I don't care when they wore no helmets. I don't care when they wore leather helmets. I'm talking about some of this football that people know Alabama is number one. You want to talk about there not being a close second? There isn't a close second to that team. And it's not recency bias. There's a reason that people can wear houndstooth. I can wear a houndstooth coat on TV. Why? Because of Bear Bryant. And then, you know why I started wearing mock turtlenecks? Because Nick Saban wore mock turtlenecks. They've even affected the culture of dressing. Alabama's number one. Notre Dame's not close. Michigan's for sure not two or three. I would take Oklahoma over them even. And I'm going to let David go because this is what David does every day. But the fact that Alabama was three and Mad Dog was comfortable with that is probably the most uncomfortable I've ever been on any Stephen A's list. <laughs> and his lists are really bad. Well, just because Saban wears mock turtlenecks doesn't mean you should either, Ryan. But that's a side topic for another day. Um, <laughs> here's, here's, here's my thing. First of all, this is exactly, Ryan, what I respect from Mad Dog. Because if you did a list from, like, 1925 to, like, 1980, this would be a pretty relevant list. List. This would be really solid. So, you know, about when Mad Dog was born to, you know, his prime, that's probably, like, when this would – how do you not have – Alabama, most national titles, most weeks at number one in the history of college football. Like, what, what do we – they have to have Alabama – dominance in all eras. We can go back as long as you want, and they got the most national titles. I, how is Ohio State not on this list? How, how do you not put Ohio State up here? Yeah. Like, you look at their last five coaches, four of the five are Hall of Famers. Like, Ryan Day's – Probably on his way yeah. to being the next one. And I know if you want to go back to Woody Hayes, he was, he was still dominant. Archie Griffin, obviously. Like, we can go back a ways. Yeah. You can't tell me Ohio State doesn't well, deserve to be on this hold list. Hold on now. Hold on, to David. Ohio State couldn't beat USC if their life depended on it in the Rose Bowl. Woody would bring that three yards <laughs> and a cloud of dust to Rose Bowl every year, and McKay would kill him. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.